Keep crawling, okay? Where am I crawling? This is the terrifying scene inside the Amtrak train that derailed in Philadelphia. Go, go, go. Help me. Dramatic cell phone video shows injured passengers helping each other out of the wreckage. Among the passengers on the Amtrak train, uh, Kayla Bonham, who spoke with Inside Edition um, as he left the hospital. You know, uh, I am very blessed uh, to be as safe as I was compared to uh, pretty much everybody else on that train. Um, there was a lot of people that are hurting on that train, and so um, I'm, I'm very fortunate to be able to walk out of that. A former Pennsylvania congressman, Patrick Murphy, was also on board. He took these dramatic photos of the trapped passengers. It was mayhem at first. There was a lot of blood and a lot of, a lot of folks got banged up, got hurt bad. I just checked my body parts. So I was okay. The guy next to me was unconscious, so I kind of slapped him a little bit and got him up, and then he was, believe it or not, okay. Among the seven dead, 20-year-old U.S. Navy midshipman Justin Zemser and this man, 48-year-old Associated Press reporter Jim Gaines. Rachel Jacobs, just named the CEO of an internet startup, is missing, and her friends are making frantic appeals on social media to find her. Emergency officials from Philadelphia are urging people who are on board that train to call Amtrak to just tell Amtrak that I'm alive and well and I'm okay. This is the actual doomed train, engine number 601. Investigators say the train was traveling at 100 miles per hour when it hit the 50 mile per hour curve where it crashed. One train that looks like it's completely in pieces. Shut down the entire northeast corridor. We have a major impact out here. We have people on the track and a couple of cars overturned. And amid all this carnage, this professional violinist is sparking outrage for complaining she lost her favorite violin. Passenger Jennifer Kim tweeted, Amtrak, thanks a lot for derailing my train. Can I please get my violin back from the second car? There was an immediate social media backlash. Distasteful, went one response. And this, your violin can wait. In the moments after the crash, hundreds of passengers found themselves in a desperate situation. Would you know how to get out alive if this happened to you? Here's Les Trent. We're on a moving train right now, so what do you do if there's an accident? With me is Scott Sauer. He's a safety expert on the train system here in the Philadelphia area. Uh, let's walk through some of the basics. What is right behind us over here? Inside this compartment is the door, is the door control. for In an emergency situation, you want to get out in a hurry, you're going, to, you're going to follow the instructions right here. Lift and open the compartment, okay. right? Press down the red handle. You'd press that down. And what that does is it frees the door that they came in on. They can actually go out to that door, slide it open manually, and get off the train. Many passengers escaped the wrecked train cars through the windows. Here's how you do it. In the event that you have to go out the window, you're going to pull this red handle. When you pull this red handle, all the rubber gasket around that window is going to come with it. You're going to discard that. It frees up the window. You're able to grab the window by a handle, pull that window in, discard it, and then you'll be able to get out this window. Go, 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 go. 